Hey guys, before we get this video started, we'd like to thank our channel partner, Mint Mobile. They're still doing a great deal for us, guys. They're giving us three months for $45. That's $15 each month. And also, guys, you know Mint Mobile, they have their exceptional customer care. Always gets it done the first time. And they also ride on the T-Mobile's 5G network. So if you want to give them a shot, a try, use our link down below and also let them know that Lowe sent you. And we'd like to give them a big thank you. And let's get this video started. Hey guys, thank you for tuning in to another video on the channel. So what I'm going to show you guys is right here. So we ended up pre-ordering on the Boost mobile side, actually, AKA Boost Infinite. So we ended up ordering the 16 Pro and 256. All right, guys, so we're here right now at the forum shops, and we're gonna get ready here to pick it up. We wanna give you guys a little bit of an experience on how it was. So it was pretty easy ordering it. So on Apple's website, you just submit, you basically submit your information, name, address, you know, phone number that's linked to you and your credit, you know, date of birth, social, you know, that stuff. If you don't have a boost account, even if you do, it still makes you add it and then it'll show that you're a current customer, stuff like that. So let's let's uh, set this up. We're gonna pick it up and then I'm gonna tell you guys how the experience was. All right, guys, we just got back over from the Apple store. As you can tell, we got the 16 Pro Max from from boost so we got a case with it too so i got the email so this email says to activate your service so we're going to click on this and then now it's asking you where did you buy your your plan from so you got choice from boost mobile amazon apple or any of the three retailers best buy target or walmart of course we're going to hit the apple store because that's where we got it from and it's going to ask me to enter the email address. So let me enter that real quick. Okay, so what they have you do is they have you enter a card for auto pay. So we're going to enter our card details to finish the auto payment. Okay, once you enter your credit card payment information for your auto pay, then now it's going to have you literally activate your phone. So let's see here. Let's hit activate now. Let's see what happens. So there you go, it brings up your phone. Okay, set up now. And let's see what happens here. Oh, this is where you can port in your number, get a new number. We're gonna get a new number, why not? Okay, so it's gonna have you it's gonna be assigned based off of your address. So let me check this out real quick. Okay, it says here, almost done to confirm your stuff, blah, blah, blah. So let's see here, start activation. And then after that, we'll open the phone and we'll get that going. Okay, now it says here, Look out for a carrier notification. So they're gonna send a notification to the phone. So we got it open, guys. Let's uh, let's see what happens. The Pro Max feels, compared to the 15 Pro Max, this feels pretty good. But it is a lot bigger though, that's for damn sure. So we're turning it on. Let's get the damn sticker out of the way. All right. And the reason why I'm doing this, guys, so you guys know how to activate if you guys do get it through Boost Mobile, because not a lot of people are giving Boost Mobile credit for the Dish Network. All right, we're just gonna skim through this real quick. So I'm gonna have to connect to my Wi-Fi. Let me connect that real quick. Okay, guys, so now it's activating the eSIM. So, a uh, so what I forgot to what I forgot to film was that there's a QR code that pops up here once you enter your Wi-Fi password to scan. If you didn't look at the email here and confirm the email stuff here, it will literally pop up a QR code here. You just scan with another phone and you can do the same setup. I should have filmed that, but oh well. 
There you go, it's activating right now. We're gonna let it activate and then we'll come right back and get this process done. And we'll show you that it's on native dish, or at least we hope. Okay, so the setup's complete, whatever. We'll set that up later. We're not worried about none of this right now. We're not worried about an iCloud right now. Okay, let's see here, set up later. There you go. But other than that guys, it's set up now. We downloaded the Boost app, we got the YouTube app, everything's good to go. So as you can see right here, boom, Boost. Let's see here. So as you guys can see, there's the installment agreement. And this is the plan right here. Even though it says $830 savings, if you try to go change the plan, it tells you the correct stuff. It's just, I guess they haven't updated that yet. Because it, liter it literally says it right here. This is the plan we're in. The iPhone, the Galaxy for iPhone, $1,000 savings. So yeah, there you guys go, guys. We are set up. We're good to go. And this is the experience of active buying and activating through the boost side. Pretty easy, guys. I highly, if Dish Boost works really good in your area, I highly recommend it. It was an easy process. It wasn't hard at all. Setup was pretty easy. It activates right away. And if you get it through Apple, it only has a 60-day lock policy, which is nice. Just like Verizon. So... All right, guys, just wanted to give you this video on the experience. All right, we're going to catch you in the next one, guys. Take it easy. Thank you to all the channel members for the love and support. As always, remember to check the affiliate link down below for Mint Mobile. Let's, let's, uh, let's get them going. All right, have a good one. Peace. Thank you for tuning in. Remember to hit the like, share, and subscribe button. Make sure to not hit the notification bell so you're always notified when we upload content. Have a great one. Peace.